good morning. Good morning, everyone. I haven't spoke to you since last year, so this is going to be my 2024 morning routine. Spice it up a little bit, give you the real honest what's going on. Um, so we always start by making my bed, always. I hope that 2023 was an amazing year for you, but I also know that 2024 is gonna be an even more amazing year. It's gonna be the best year yet, yet. For all of you guys so i hope you made your vision boards i hope you feel motivated and excited for this new year because i know so many amazing things are coming your way <laughs> that's been do anything that i can make it horrible me and my boyfriend have a stuffed animal family and every day we try to make it like look cool on the bed or sit them differently this is Angel Bear I've had my whole life. This is Nelson the Narwhal. This is Holly, I got it for Christmas. And then this is, oh my God, why is my brain broken? Manny, oh my gosh, what am I doing? I'm so sorry, Manny. This is how they're gonna sit today. Manny, why are you doing that, bro? Very cute. Babe, do you wanna see how the, the jelly cats are today? How they're sitting? <laughs> No way. Is it cute? Yeah, I like it. It looks good. Did you organize it for a certain reason? Or yeah, just strength is on the outside. The strength? Yeah. Really? Okay, next thing in the morning routine is eat. I am such a breakfast person. I always have to eat. If I don't eat in the morning, I am literally a horrible person. I am mean. I will bite you. I will eat you. So we start off by making some food. We usually make wraps with eggs, but today I'm going to do bagels because they're going to get moldy if I don't use them. Fire, fire, hee <laughs> hee. Okay, we were gonna have breakfast and then do a workout at home, but I think instead we're gonna go to spin class tonight. Yay! Living my favorite thing, my favorite place. So let's make some breakfast and then journal. We're making bagel sandwiches. <laughs> I'm in love with an emo girl. Shake, 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 senora. Shake your body right. Work, 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 senora. Zone, zone, senora. Booter. While I make breakfast, I thought I would talk to you guys about some of my goals for 2024 and the things that I am manifesting, the things that are gonna come true, that are gonna happen. So the first thing that I'm manifesting in 2023 is I wanna start doing acting, okay? I wanna enter my acting era. I wanna be in a Netflix TV show. I wanna be in a movie. I wanna walk the red carpet for a movie or a TV show that I'm in. For anyone who hasn't been around since 2016, it was more than just 2016. I used to do acting when I was a kid and I was on like a family channel TV show and stuff. And I've always loved acting. Wow, I really sound like I'm flexing right now. I'm not flexing at all. It's literally not a flex. I was like that theater kid. So I just wanna get back to that and do that again. Fuel my soul. Intermission to crack the eggs. If you like it, then you should have put a lid on it. If you like it, then you should have put a lid on it. Don't be mad that you didn't put a lid on it. The next thing that I'm manifesting is that I want to travel a lot and not just for work. I want to go to Europe really badly and this might come as a surprise to you guys it is also a surprise to me but i want to begin the manifestation process of living closer to my family i currently live really far from my family and it's really hard on me so even though i literally just moved here i am struggling so i don't know if that means moving or what but i just want some kind of sign Turns out it's actually really hard to cook and record on two phones at the same time. So everything's a little bit burnt. Sorry, babe. I'm trying. I am also manifesting, hoping, and praying for lots of modeling. Last year, I had the opportunity to model for Hollister, and it was so sick, and I had so much fun. I just want to do it again, and I want to do it all the time. Like, tell me why modeling is literally the most fun thing ever. I want to be able to go into every Aries store and see myself literally in the store. Breakfast is served. Unfortunately, it's burnt, but this one isn't. A burnt breakfast is better than no breakfast. Mine isn't burnt, yours is burnt. Okay. <laughs> we are making our greens like we drink every single day. My favorite kind is the Bloom Mango flavor. Literally the best. We also add a couple extra like supplements into our greens. So I'm adding that right now. 
and trace minerals amazing guys i literally keep seeing angel numbers this is my year you guys know i'm on my grind to be taking my vitamins so i got one of those cute little cases i can all my broken now Okay guys, we are doing some journaling now. I'm trying to actually get on top of journaling because I feel like I never, ever actually do it. And I have a thousand journals. I just never touch them, but this is the year. Okay, it says, what's on my mind? I feel like now I need to like intuitively think what's actually on my mind because on my mind right now is that I'm stressed. I feel like I have a thousand things to do. So I know the end of this month is gonna get really busy because I'm traveling three different places. So what's on my mind right now is that I need to soak in the calm before the chaos. I am productive and allowed to sleep in, trust my body. A slow period is the perfect time to relax and recharge. Opportunity is on its way for me. We are almond milk people. I never have oat milk. I don't like the taste of oat milk. Oat milk slander is allowed in this house, okay? I'm just kidding, but I want to know, do you like almond milk, oat milk, or just normal milk? Because for me, it's oat milk is on the bottom. What you're gonna need, almond milk, almond milk creamer in the taste of caramel. We are making an almond milk, or a grande shake espresso with almond milk caramel. And I got ice cubes. We make some coffee, some espresso. What is going on in here? In the espresso machine. <coughs> we want to talk about the absolute worst type of person. The worst type of person is the person who uses the ice cubes and doesn't refill it. And then you go and you try and get ice and there's no ice cubes. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Check, check, check. Check, check, check. I'm at the very end of this bottle. Why do I feel like that was genuinely like the perfect amount? Anyways, now we froth this up. Wow. Stunning. Color, I'm gonna rate it an eight out of 10. Smell, 10 out of 10. Taste, 8.5 out of 10. My bathroom is just like so girly like this is just girlhood this is clearly the boys corner but i'm just obsessed with my bathroom now is the skincare time how's the coffee what do you rate it really good like this is honestly top tier really i said 8.5 the smell is a 10 the color is an 8 and the taste is 8.5 why what could be better the caramel is just bleh. I have been obsessed with using a gua sha recently because I had a very swollen face, so using a gua sha has been like literally my cure. And I've literally been using ultrasound gel. I saw this girl on TikTok say she uses it, and I personally love it. And it doesn't cause any pimples for me, I just double cleanse my face. Um, but it's amazing, so gua sha on my face with me. Oh, I love it and I hate it at the same time. <laughs> no, no, no. Stick to the stuff you know. Wow, that's amazing. So this is the time in the day where I would put some time aside for me and I would set my intention for the day, tell myself everything I'm going to achieve today and everything I'm going to achieve the rest of my life and how much I believe in myself. Because the most important thing is that you believe in yourself. I find I constantly tell myself like, oh my gosh, I'm so unmotivated, like I'm not productive. So the affirmations that I'm focusing on this year I am so motivated. I am productive. Self-care is productive. Taking a break is productive. Because that's the reminder that I really need to hear. Oh my gosh, this feels so good. If you guys want like a full in-depth skincare routine, nighttime, morning, everything, let me know. Because I feel like I'm, I've been super into skincare my entire life. I love skincare. And I've tried like every product. So let me know if you want my routine and I'll give it to you. I'm not a gatekeeper. Baby, I'm wearing eye masks on our hot girl walk. 
Before we take these curls out, please, please let them look good. They are manifesting good curls. Good hair day. I don't have my glasses on, so I can't even see anyways. <laughs> oh, I love it and I hate it at the same time. Does it look good, guys? I can't see. I feel like they need to be brushed through. Oh my gosh, when I was in grade 11, I went to semi-formal and I didn't brush my curls through. And every time I look at those photos, it literally haunts me. Why didn't any of my friends tell me to brush my hair through? Why didn't I know to brush my hair through? Straight, curly, great. It is now officially time for a hot couple walk. Leave me adjust. Today's OOTD is a white fox sweat set. So three, two, one. I am officially back from the hot girl walk. We actually ended up walking and doing some errands at the same time. So what kind of fan would I be if I didn't show you what I got? It's a shopping haul. So I got one of those for Christmas from Shoppers Drugware. I got one of those like discovery kits. So I got to smell all the different perfumes, choose my favorite and then get a full size. This is literally, you wanna know what I smell like? I love this. Okay, this is the one I chose. This is the Ariana Grande Mod in blush. It's pink and it smells so good. I actually already own it, but I was running out. So I'm like, I need to restock on it. It's so good. I also got, this is my favorite mouthwash. It literally keeps your breath so fresh. It's kind of expensive, I'm not gonna lie, but it does really work like it's really good it's worth it and then i got black seed oil because i am running out and put that right into my cabinet here and then we stopped by the dollar store because i want to make rosemary water and rosemary oil my hair is very thin and this is the year that i'm going to grow my hair she's gonna get thicker and my hair literally used to be to here and then i cut it now it's just like damaged from using so many heat products i want it to be here again so i saw on tiktok everyone's using like rosemary water so i got these for rosemary water and then i couldn't find like the little droppers so i'm just gonna use like these travel stuff and make some rosemary oil at home and then, this is not an ad, but I had a package at my door, so obviously gonna open it with you guys. It is from Bloom. You guys know I literally drank Bloom this morning. I do work with Bloom, disclaimer, but this is not an actual ad. Like, I'm not supposed to be talking about them right now. Here it is, guys. Ta-da! Ooh! Okay, this is the coconut flavor. This is the berry flavor. If you guys know me, you know I'm like scared of things that are flavored berry. I don't know if that makes sense. So I'm gonna gift this to one of my friends for sure. But yeah, I'm scared of anything that's red, anything that's blue. I just have this weird phobia of flavors and colors, but I do like greens. And then the coconut one, I do like that. My favorite is the mango, it's so good. And then they sent this frother. So cute. Oh my God, I'm gonna have one like for coffees and one for greens. It was literally perfect. And I think there's another, what is this? Is it a water bottle? Stop, that is so cute. Oh my gosh. Wait, I'm obsessed. That is so cute. I'm gonna be using that, put her away. And then I feel like this is a sweater. Is this is what? I ripped it right out. Size extra large, yes. Oh, cute. It says greens, 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 greens. Bloom. Oh my God, I'm gonna love this with like green tights. So slay. Well guys, that is my morning routine. Obviously on a slow morning where I'm not doing anything. I don't like just dawdle around like that. Um, but that is my, maybe the better thing is ideal morning routine. If I had time to do everything I want and just relax with a slow morning because I love, love, love slow mornings. But that's my morning routine. Thank you for watching and I love you and hope to see you soon.